did everything. Hey guys, a lot of us when we're trying to get our foot in the door struggle with getting some relevant resume experience. Usually internships are a pretty good place to start. And I try to stay away from um, giving like must have advice. And that's not what this video is about. This video is about telling you how I got my first internship and maybe you can get yours if you follow the same sort of thing and you do the same things I did. Um, and hopefully it'll work out for you. So one thing that a lot of people don't know about is that Obviously, you're going to be applying to jobs and you're going to be applying to internships, but you can actually post your resume on Craigslist. Now, uh, you'll see right here, we're in the resume section. We just typed in developer, and these are people with years of experience, but you also can post yours looking for internships. When I when I got my first internship, I was applying and I saw this resume section. I start, I posted my resume, and it's the uh, same thing that we have here. We have our little... Uh, a Novo Resume download. You can go ahead and make your own for free on their website, NovoResume.com. Huge fan of it. I'm not sponsored or anything, but this is what I put up as a picture. But I also uh, gave a detailed description. Obviously, my LinkedIn was set up as well. And I ended up getting three or four calls over the next week for people asking me to come in and uh, if I was interested, uh, be interviewed. And I ended up taking the first one that was offered at a web design shop that was like an hour and 45 minutes away for like $12 an hour. But more importantly, I was just excited to get that relevant resume experience where I had an internship. Then I ended up getting hired as a freelancer with that company. But this was kind of a uh, oh, something that I don't think a lot of people know that there's even a resume section to uh, Craigslist. So if that's something that you would be comfortable doing and that you're looking for internships, go ahead and post it on the resume section. And you never know, you may uh, get a call. I got a couple in the week that I put it up and I had filled out hundreds after that. Like just LinkedIn, ZipRecruiter, um, Craigslist, and I saw the resume section. This was ended up being how I got my first internship and relevant work experience. And I, you know, I don't know if you'll get a great, like, high paying internship, but at least you'll get that resume experience. And obviously, depends on the company. But make sure you use all the relevant keywords. Maybe put every language in in there: JavaScript, front end developer, back end developer, web design, Android, whatever you're looking, whatever you're looking to get into. Make sure you go ahead and put that in there so that when those companies are looking to hire you know a summer intern or maybe just someone for part-time they have they can find you in the resume section on craigslist well that's my two bits that's how i got my first internship and then i hope if you if you haven't got one and you're looking for one you take advantage of this it's it's about five minutes of your time and if you got an internship another way i'd love to know go ahead and, and uh, tell me in the comments below and maybe we'll share a 10 ways of getting an internship in software because i know it's a grind guys so uh thanks for watching don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And support me on patreon.com slash codenotorials360. We can get a whole bunch of cool perks. I'll see you guys in the next video. And if you want me to do more of these sort of talking suggestion videos, let me know also. I'll, I'll love to share what little bits of uh, experience I have uh, in the future. Thanks for watching, guys. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching the video. If you're interested in coding boot camp, check out devmountain.com where housing is included in your price of tuition. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and support me on Patreon. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.